Hello lovely people and welcome. Thank you so much for visiting my channel today. This painting is one I'm kind of psyched about because here I'm combining two different aspects of my life. Uh, so in uh, real life, <laughs> in my day job, I am a research technician in a cancer research laboratory. And the laboratory I'm in, in particular, is very interested in the vasculature of tumors and how that affects uh, drug delivery and things like that. So in tumors in general, the vascular is, vasculature is often quite messed up, and this has ramifications in terms of drug delivery and uh, other treatments because pretty much everything depends on the blood to carry the uh, treatment into the tumor, and if the vessels are messed up in there, it becomes more difficult to uh, effectively treat the tumor. So one of the things that we are very interested in my lab and several other labs that uh, study this is a cell type called a parasite, P-E-R-I-C-Y-T-E. -E. And what a parasite is, is a cell that lies around or on top of the blood vessel and helps maintain the health and homeostasis of the blood vessel walls. And one of the things we see in tumors is a disruption of this uh, coverage, what we call parasite coverage. And so I thought that I would uh, paint a painting of parasites on blood vessels. Um, we often use fluorescent microscopy to look at this in our experiments. And uh, one way, common colors for doing this are a green fluorescent uh, signal um, and red fluorescent signals. And so I chose here to make the blood vessels green and the parasites. Uh, here I'm tried out a purple, but I like the red better. So I went back and covered the purple one up with the red. Uh, so I have red parasites lying around green vessels in this painting. And as you can see, I built this up in many, many layers and I tried to give it the depth of vessels in the background. And while in the fluorescent images, you're not going to see shadows the way I'm portraying in the painting, that doesn't uh, translate very well to the painting. So I decided to spend a bunch of time working on highlights and shadows and trying to give the uh, much more three-dimensional looking uh, image in the painting. Uh, so it's not quite, not what you would see exactly under a microscope, but uh, I wasn't really going for a microscopic image. I was going more for a representation of what these might look like. So it's really, really interesting to try to find ways to combine the different things, different aspects of my life. And I'm going to probably do a bunch more of this if I can. Uh, think of ways of representing uh, other things I'm interested in. So uh, this was a lot of fun. So as you can see here, I built it up in many, many layers. I started with a black, and then I worked in a bunch of vessels in the background, which uh, are actually way too dark, as you can see in this picture here. Um, you can't really see them, and I will brighten them up later near the end of the painting process. Um, and then in order to make the things in the foreground uh, shine more because many of these paints are somewhat translucent, not entirely opaque. I first put down a layer of white paint, which uh, titanium white does tend to be much more opaque. So you put down a layer of that and then put your colors on top of that and it makes the colors stand out a lot more than if you just painted them down over the black, as you can tell here. And then it was mostly just a matter of repeatedly going back over and uh, tightening up the, the darks and the lights, giving it more of a, a feeling of, of depth and roundness, making the uh, shadowing on the vessels work, and also trying to make them a little bit darker as they went away from you to keep the focus forwards. Um, so that's really all that's involved. There's not a lot of fancy technique in the painting itself. Um, it's more the idea that I thought was very interesting. And uh, I hope you uh, think it's interesting too. Uh, let me know 
uh, in the com in the comments if uh, going into the science is interesting or not. Um, I think it's fun. I like learning about things. So here I am deepening the shadows up even more. I'm pretty close to the end of the uh, foreground here. And after I've gone in and gotten happy with what I see in the foreground, I uh, went back in and started brightening up the uh, vessels that are farther back so that it looks more like a network of vessels with depth. So all in all, I really like how this came out. Uh, tell me if you like it in the comments. And uh, as always, if you like this and want to see more, please like this video, please subscribe to my channel, and take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and be well. Thank you so much.